Hello friends, once again welcome back to the automotive basic session. I am Somshekar and back with the bit time segments of CAN protocol. As you all know, CAN bit time is divided into four segments such as sync segment, propagation segment, phase buffer segment 1 and phase buffer segment 2. Now let's discuss the purpose of sync synchronization segment in a CAN bit time. Following synchronization of transmitter and receiver, the transmitter starts sending its frame bit by bit. For proper interpretation of bit, the bit edges are expected to occur in the synchronization segment appropriately. As you can see in this slide, this is the synchronization segment. For proper interpretation of the bit by the receiver, the edges are expected to occur in this time quanta, in this segment sorry not time quanta in this segment anyway time quanta also we can say because the sync segment is always having a fixed number of time quanta that is 1 TQ now you may ask what if the edge occurs before this sync segment or after the sync segment it leads to an error in a CAN network that error is called as a edge phase error and it is denoted by E in a CAN network. Now you may ask what is edge phase error? Edge phase error means improper occurrence of a bit edge. You can see in this slide improper occurrence means if the edge is occurring before and after the sync segment means the improper occurrence of edge that we will call it as a edge phase error and the phase error of an edge is given by the position of the edge relative to the sync segment measured in time quantas you can see in this slide and I, I have already explained you how the edge phase error will occur in a CAN network friends let's understand when edge phase error will occur in a CAN network anyway I have already explained the same but we will understand now with the simple cases case 1 case 2 and case 3 to make it very clear consider the case 1 suppose the transmitter transmitting its bit to a receiver if the bit edge occurs for receiver within the sync segment that means the proper le or legitimate occurrence within the sync segment then there will not be any edge phase error that means E is equal to 0 consider the second case if the edge lies before the sync segment as I already said before the sync segment then the edge phase error will be greater than 0 that means the E is equal to greater than 0 and consider the case 3 the edge lies after the sync segment you can see in this here slide after sync segment means here so the edge phase error E will be less than 0 now you may ask how these errors will be get corrected or get resolved in a CAN network these errors are overcame in a CAN network with the help of phase buffer segment 1 and phase buffer segment 2 you can see in this by lengthening and shortening of the duo phase buffer segment 1 and phase buffer segment 2 for queries please leave comments below if you enjoyed this video please subscribe to my channel secrets of automotive industry and hit thumbs up thank you all